believe this. Disgusting video clip footage shows a man seated in an airport terminal with his top wide open and stomach on show. He urinates onto the floor with the passengers nearby. The footage shows the moment a man urinates on an airport waiting area in plain sight and surrounded by other passengers. The man can be seen sitting in an airport terminal, spraying a fountain of urine onto the floor, seemingly unbothered by short passengers nearby. The video was posted on the Instagram account Passenger Shaming on January 1st, captioned <coughs> All next year. Yes, this is a passenger urinating in the terminal. To date, the video clips been viewed more than 229,000 times. One person asked, Why isn't anybody doing anything about this? Just sitting there watching? Another viewer appalled wrote, Jesus Mary and Joseph, what in the world would possess nobody to behave this way? Others were more bemused than average by the foul act. One wrote, What a slob. Good alarm the general public. And one passenger on the day was heard to say, Can't blame him. Bloody toilets could be a long way off. He's not hurting anybody. Only five days into the new year. And passengers already called out fellow travelers on disgusting behavior. Women encouraged to let body hair grow for January campaign this month. The January campaign was originally started by 22-year-old Laura Jackson from Warwickshire and encourages women to let their body hair grow naturally during the annual month of January to encourage acceptance and raise money for charity. Currently, women across the globe are being encouraged to ditch razors and wax strips for the month of January in a bid to encourage the acceptance of body hair on women. The January Hairy campaign was first launched last year to empower women to embrace their natural bodies whilst also raising money for charity. It was started by Lord Arthur She said advertising and the media industry and forced the idea that the natural hair women grow on their bodies is unattractive and distasteful. Kicking off the campaign for its second year, January Harry is again encouraging women to let their body hair grow naturally for the month in an effort to normalize the look. The official Facebook page out on the first day of the month a very hairy new year to you all! Laura told journalists, Today marks the first day of January 2020, where women all over the world come together to put our razors for the month of January. Advertising and the media industries have forced the idea that natural hair women grow on their bodies is unattractive and distasteful, so let's educate one another on all the experiences within this prickly subject. Our charity focus this year is to support Trey Sisters in protecting, restoring and funding reforestation. Even if you're not personally joining in with January this year, I encourage you to talk about it with others. If we say the same things over and over again, it becomes normal. Just start casually including it in everyday places like ads, magazines, movies, etc. without calling attention to it. Eventually, it will just become commonplace. Another woman told journalists, It'd be nice if we were shame for being human. Harry is aiming to raise £2,500 for Tree Sisters, which fights to protect and restore natural habitats in order to tackle climate change. 